Let's go over this multiple choice question about cell transport together. What distinguishes active transport versus passive transport? Remember that active transport needs energy and it moves from low to high concentrations. Passive transport does not need energy and it goes from high to low concentrations. So with that being said, let's look at our answers. A, active transport moves molecules down their concentration gradient. That means high to low. We're not looking for high to low. That means A is out. B, active transport does not require ATP. ATP is our energy currency. It's what the cell uses for energy. So active transport does require, that means B is wrong. C, active transport moves molecules against their concentration gradient. That against their concentration gradient means from low to high. And I think this is our answer. Let's check on D and E though. D, active transport only happens with polar molecules. Nope, it happens with polar and nonpolar molecules. And then E, active transport occurs only when equilibrium is reached. Nope, passive transport can do that too. So our answer here of C is the right answer.